All right, another video for integrals uh, involving inverse trigonometric functions. So we have uh, this number, integral of 1 over radical minus 3 plus 4x minus x squared is equal to bx for sure, is equal to integral. Again, what is the integral? of du which is u prime dx du or u prime dx over radical 1 minus u square that is equal to sine inverse of u plus c right so what is that <coughs> it's a uh, dx over right radical let's keep the minus 3 plus plus <clears throat> what is uh, okay let me make it easier for you what I do is I just leave the plus x square if we have number multiplied with x square we have to make it uh, common right minus into x square minus 4x plus 3 all right this might be easier the x over radical minus into x squared minus 4x for sure we can add 4 subtract 4 right why because 4 is the coefficient of x divided by 2 always it's 2 square it it's 4 plus 4 minus 4 and we leave the plus 3 aside so it is equal to integral of dx over radical minus x x squared minus 4x plus 4 is an identity which is x minus 2 square right and minus 4 plus 3 is minus 1 but multiplied with this minus outside it will be plus 1 so i can rewrite it as integral of dx right let me leave it over radical 1 minus x minus 2 square so what is u over here it's x minus 2 so let me make du x minus 2 because and without changing anything because this is equal to dx the same because derivative of x minus 2 is 1 right so now what do we have du right as this exactly of a radical 1 minus u square so the final answer is going to be sine inverse u which is x minus 2 let's see done let's see another example <clears throat> let's see another example let me just check what example do you want me to, to do? Example 3, page 61. Done the activity 2. Okay, example 3, <coughs> page 61. Okay. It's integral of 1 over, integral, definite integral from 0 to 3, 1 over 9 plus x squared dx. Okay, this one, it's, uh, it's it looks like uh, integral, this is the rule of it, right, of uh, u prime dx or du, I prefer to put it du, u prime dx over 1 plus u square, which is equal tangent inverse of uh, u plus c, right? So we should have 1. Again, it's integral from 0 to 3 of dx over 9 comma into 1 plus x square over 9, right? So it's integral from 0 to 3 dx over 9 into 1 plus x over 3 all squared. So this is u. u is x over 3. That's great. So integral from 0 to 3 of du, right, over 1 plus u squared. When I, when I did choose the x over 3 as u, du is dx over 3, which makes 1 over 3 dx. I have already the, the dx, so what what we have more, we have 1 over 3. But what do we have here? We have 1 over 9. We still need more 3, so we take 1 over 3 outside. If we do derivative now, if we do now derivative of d of 1x over 3, we get 1 over 3 times this 1 over 3. It gives me 1 over 9, so we are good. The answer is 1 over 3, integral of du over 1, 1 plus u squared, it's tangent inverse of u right from 0 to 3 
So we just uh, substitute, right? We just substitute. It's 1 over 3 tangent of tangent inverse of 3 over 3, which is 1 minus 1 over 3 tangent inverse of 0. Tangent inverse of 0 is 0, and tangent 1 is pi over 4. Tangent inverse of 1 is pi over 4. Times 1 over 3, the answer is pi over 12. Okay, <clears throat> let's do another example. Integral of 1 over 5 plus 4x plus 4x squared. All right, what I, dx for sure. So let's put dx over here. It's integral of dx over... What I do, I start with the coefficient of x squared, it should be 1, so I'll take 4 common, it's 4 into x squared, plus 4x over x, it's x, let's leave the 5 alone outside, which is equal, integral of dx over 4, let me complete the square over here, because I need u squared, right, it's x squared plus x, what is one, uh, coefficient of x, it's 1 divided by 2, it's half square root. it's 1 over 4, minus 1 over 4, and plus 5 outside, which is equal to integral, of dx over 4 into x plus 1 over 2 square, which is this as an identity square, and uh, minus 1, right? Because minus 1 over 4 multiplied with this 4, so minus 1 outside and plus 5, it's plus 4 simply. So it is equal integral of, let's say, let's say 1 over 4, I'm taking this 4 common. What I do have left, dx over 1 plus, right, 4 divided by 4, it's 1. And 4 into x plus half square divided by 4, it's x plus half square. Now, it's 1 over 4 integral of du. I need du, not dx. When we have x square, we take dx. When we have u square, we need du, okay? What I have changed, I got a change or no. It's not because derivative of x plus half is, <clears throat> without square here, sorry. It's du. Derivative of x plus half is 1, 1 dx. So I didn't change anything. What I have left is dx, and that's great. So we continue now. It's 1 over 4, right? It's 1 over 4. du over 1 plus u squared, which is tangent inverse u. Tangent inverse u plus c, and that's it. Let's do another one. I don't know if you have time to do that. Let's see. It's integral of for x plus 7 over x squared plus 2x plus 2. That's great. dx. <clears throat> this one, I don't know if you have time for it. I, I will start and we continue in the another, another video. It's equal to. This one is uh, uh, <clears throat> it's partial fraction. And we can do it as partial fraction. But it's easy to uh, uh, to do this. The 7, I, div I divide it into integral for x plus 4, so I can take 4 as common, over x squared plus 2x plus 2 dx, plus integral of 3, right, over x squared plus 2x plus 2, because we have 7. Now, I split it that those as two parts, right? Here, this one, I can work with it as tangent inverse, and this one, I can have it as lin. Let's see how. Let's see how it's equal to integral since the u, <clears throat> right, is x squared plus 2x plus 2. So I should have a du dx squared plus 2x plus 2 because integral, simply integral of du over u, integral of integral of du over u, it's simply lin u, right, lin absolute value of u plus c. It's lin absolute value of u plus c. Is that okay? Now, now, the problem is where I made 4x plus 4 goes. I'm not taking let u equal and uh, doing it the, the, the way that we used to do, but we can do it fast here. Uh, what is the uh, derivative of x squared plus 2x plus 2? It's simply 2x plus 2, right? Multiplied with dx. Do we have 2x plus 2? No, we have 4x plus 4, so I still need to multiply with 2 to get my answer. I multiplied with 2. Then, plus, this one here is simply dx, right? 3dx over x squared plus 2x plus 2. 
I want to comp complete the square over here. X square plus 2x plus 2 divided by 2, 1 square.